Peace family. It's Young Aries. You already know how I'm rocking. Young Aries the king. And today we're here to talk about a very important topic. Today I am here to talk about nothing other than the flat earth theory. And the globe theory exposed. I'm about to prove to you in three ways. Three ways. How this earth is flat. Number one is the north star. There's a north star called Polaris. Right? This star sits directly above the North Pole, right? And through any season and through every day, you can bet your bottom dollar the North Star will be shining right 90 degrees above the Earth at its pole. Now, you could go anywhere on planet Earth and see that star. Now, if this world was a globe and you were, let's say, on the side of the globe, the curvature wouldn't allow you to see it because you would be looking through land. If you're on the North Pole, of course you can see it. But how are people in Oklahoma and, and China seeing it if they're at this side of the globe? They'll have to see through land. But Polaris is viewed almost anywhere throughout the country any season. That proves to you that this world is not a globe. Not only that, if this world was a globe and it is traveling at 70, and let's say at least 50,000 miles per hour, how about I say, flinging, it's going fast, and it's spinning on this axis, right? Every 24 hours, it does a complete revolution, it spins. It's just moving. And you obviously, your common sense is telling you shit ain't moving if Polaris, the North Star, is at the same spot every fucking day, every fucking season. What the fuck? Everyone on the planet, I can see that. Not only that, if you go to the coast of New York and go 300 feet behind, take 300 feet back in the water, right? You will still see a straight coastal line. If you go 300 miles back, and if the coastal line is still visible, it will be straight. Now, scientists say you are seeing a mirage. What do they mean, mirage? Scientists are trying to say that the image is being reflected off the water, bouncing. Really? Really? So this is what science is saying is the reason why you can see the coast from up to 200 miles. But family, you have to understand, if you can see the coast from up to 200, 300 miles, shouldn't there be curvature? They say for every couple miles, there's curvature. So 300 miles, that's 300-fold curvature. It's, you shouldn't be able to see that coast from 300 miles away. The earth would have been curved. You would just be seeing water. So they're saying it's a mirage. You really going to believe that if common sense is showing you the shit right there, nigga? Number two, there is a dome over this earth. You look at every kid movie, every cartoon, every show, there's propaganda. Propaganda of what, family? There's propaganda that there is a dome and it's over the earth. Now, NASA is a fucking snake tongue. NASA. Serpent's tongue. That's all it fucking means. If you believe NASA went to the moon, Use a fucking lie. Because before the space race started, America and Russia started buying a bunch of nukes and started shooting up. But the nukes would explode before they hit the dome. These niggas were trying to literally blow up the dome with atom bombs and still couldn't. NASA knows for a fact it can't leave Earth. Somebody is lying. 
every class you go to, every grade, the world is a globe. That's propaganda. They don't give you your own judgment to think, hmm, this shit is flat. So NASA never makes movies based on the moon. There's never ever been any real movies in Hollywood based on landing on the moon. Why? Because if they show you that their CGI and their 3D technology is so good they could fake a movie where they're on the moon, they'll be exposing themselves as to how they faked it a couple decades back when JFK was popping. So they faked this shit. Look at the moon landing. Look at the moon rover. There's no dirt within the the uh the little uh the the pad like cubes, the sponges that are on the each leg of the rover. And if this rover really had a machine that was thrusting down to push up, there would be dirt everywhere. Them niggas ain't get to the moon. There's a dome. Nobody can escape. Only through the astro. And they don't know this, but we do. Peace family, we out. Flat earthers, truthers.